Here are some of the craziest food world records out there. Number 12, chicken nugget. After hearing about what chicken nuggets might really be made of, I'm slightly wary of the biggest chicken nugget ever, which is a gigantic singular nugget that weighs just over 50 pounds. This monster nugget was constructed by Empire Kosher in celebration of its 75th anniversary. Its official size was 51.1 pounds and it stood over three feet tall while being two feet wide. Hey, I think this is a challenge my favorite chicken nugget maker, Chick-fil-A, can take on. Empire Kosher is the largest producer of kosher poultry in the United States. This nugget took more than three hours to cook and is the size of about 750 normal-sized nuggets and was cooked in a giant 500-gallon fryer for 45 minutes. And yes, it's all kosher. <laughs> Largest chicken nugget is a new category for Guinness World Records, and a spokesperson said that the nugget needed to be over 33 pounds to win the distinction. There actually was no previous record holder, so why exactly is 33 pounds the cutoff to be a world record? Hmm. Number 11, mac and cheese. Scientific research has shown that mac and cheese was everyone's favorite dish at one point in their lives, and while I might have just made that up, one thing I do know is that there are a ton of mac and cheese lovers out there. Chef and author John Fulce, who I guess is one of those mac and cheese lovers out there, cooked about 2,400 pounds of mac and cheese, setting the new world record for the largest bowl of macaroni and cheese ever. 660 pounds of macaroni, 102 pounds of Monterey Jack cheese, and 186 pounds of white cheddar cheese were some of the ingredients used. This endeavor, like many others, also doubled as a charity event by raising funds for the New Orleans area Habitat for Humanity. The previous Guinness World Record for the largest bowl of macaroni and cheese was only 414 pounds. Number 10, hamburger. Hold up. A, a casino is in the business of cooking up the world's largest hamburger? But that's exactly what happened, as Black Bear Casino Resort in Carleton, Minnesota cooked up a world record bacon cheeseburger. It was 10 feet in diameter and weighed 2 thousand and fourteen pounds to be exact this ginormous burger used 60 pounds of bacon mm. 50 pounds of lettuce 50 pounds of sliced onions 50 pounds of pickles and 40 pounds of cheese it took about four hours and 350 degrees to cook the patty and more than seven hours to bake the bun the special outdoor oven powered by propane torches and 15 foot steel skillets were specially built to get this world record. An actual crane had to be used to flip the burger. The previous record holder was less than half this burger's size at only 881 pounds, 13 ounces. Think there's gonna be a five figure burger one day? Number nine, nachos. Hundreds of people chipped in to create and devour over 4,600 pounds serving of nachos in Lawrence, Kansas. At 80 feet long, 3 feet wide, and more than 10 inches tall, this super cheesy creation was recognized by Guinness World Records as the world's largest serving of nachos. Event hospitality provider, a center plate Mexican restaurant, Salty Iguana, the University of Kansas Athletics Department, and Lawrence Interdenominational Nutrition Kitchen collaborated to prepare this massive amount of nachos. This record wasn't broken without some setbacks, however. A cooler broke down on the evening before the event, and these guys lost almost 2,000 pounds worth of ingredients. Volunteers had to act fast to bring as much food as they could, and the event coordinators had to go to nearby stores to buy the rest. In the end, the nachos contained 765 pounds of nacho chips, 405 pounds of salsa, 323 pounds of tomato, 918 pounds of meat and beans, and more than 2,200 pounds of cheese. Proceeds from the event went to L-I-N-K, a charity which provides meals for low-income families. Number 8. Gingerbread House The most wonderful time of the year was made even sweeter, over 35 million calories sweeter to be exact, in Texas, when the world's largest gingerbread house was made. Out to prove everything is bigger in Texas, the Traditions Club and St. Joseph Health System of Bryan, Texas decided to beat the Guinness World Record for the world's largest gingerbread house. Hmm, interesting way to wrap the healthcare system, but eh, whatever. Anyways, after endless icing tests, material donations, and baking shifts, the team succeeded. According to the Traditions Club, the gingerbread house was 60 feet long, 42 feet wide, and 20 feet tall. 
The structure may have started as a wood base, but it took 1,800 pounds of butter, 7,200 eggs, and 3,000 pounds of sugar, 7,200 pounds of flour, and countless volunteers to become a record-breaking reality. These figures beat out the previous reigning gingerbread giant built at the Mall of America in Minnesota. To put that in perspective, if this gingerbread house were a midtown Manhattan apartment, it would cost you about $10,000 a month to rent. Makes sense? Number seven, pizza. The largest pizza ever made happened to be gluten-free. For all you guys out there that's into that, the pizza had a total surface area of over 13,000 square feet and it weighed over 51,000 pounds. This huge pizza was prepared by a team of Italians from Nip Food in Rome, Italy back in 2012. The pizza was named Ottavia, a word of Roman origin for eighth son, as an homage to the first Roman Emperor Octavian Augustus, who brought about a big change in the history of Rome and brought the empire into a period of economic and cultural unrest. The pie included 19,800 pounds of flour, 10,000 pounds of tomato sauce, 8,800 pounds of mozzarella cheese, 1,488 pounds of margarine, 551 pounds of rock salt, 220 pounds of lettuce, and 55 pounds of vinegar. I had no clue vinegar was used to make pizza, but then again, I've made exactly zero pizzas from scratch myself. The five chefs spent over 48 hours baking the dough in over 5,000 batches. Otavia was made 100% gluten-free as a way of educating and spreading a message to the world about the importance of health-conscious food choices. Number six, chocolate bar. Thornton's Chocolate of London decided to produce a mega bar to celebrate its 100th birthday. And judging by the size of this bar, there were a lot of bulging stomachs as a result of this confectionery construction. This chocolate bar weighed in at a ridiculous 12,770 pounds. It took about 10 hours to fill the mold and another three days to cool the chocolate off. The previous record was held by American confectionery maker World's Finest Chocolate, who managed to create a treat weighing in at a pretty impressive five and a half tons. That's nothing to sneeze at either. Thornton's claim to have made this world record bar with the exact same recipe as its classic milk chocolate bars. All staff were asked to come up with ideas of how to celebrate the 100th birthday, but the idea for this giant chocolate bar came from a chocolate-loving employee who was a big fan of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Imagine that, loving chocolate and working in an actual chocolate factory. Number five, chocolate chip cookie. In 2003, Immaculate Baking Company created a 40,000 pound chocolate chip cookie measuring over 100 feet in diameter to capture the record for world's biggest cookie. Ingredients used included over 6,000 pounds of chocolate chips, 12,000 pounds of unbleached flour, 6,500 pounds of unsalted butter, and 5,000 pounds of granulated sugar. And uh, oh yeah, 10 gallons of vanilla. Engineered in Hendersonville, North Carolina, the cookie was baked in a structureless 78 50 foot long oven specially designed for baking this huge cookie for five to six hours. Following the event, the cookie was cut and sold, and 100% of the proceeds were donated to the Folk Artists Foundation. Too bad nobody thought of filling a huge glass of milk and putting it right next to it. Number four, sushi roll. You would think that since the Italians are holding the record for the largest pizza and Americans hold the record for the largest burger, you'd expect that the record holder for the longest sushi would be Japanese. Well, not exactly. A Japanese restaurant in Russia, in the city of Yekaterinburg, made a sushi roll that needed to be measured, not in pieces, but in football fields. Determined to break the world record for longest sushi roll, this Japanese restaurant set out to make a sushi roll that's slightly over one and a half miles long. It took 60 chefs, one and a half tons of rice, and 14,000 pieces of seaweed to make this ridiculous roll. Oh, they brought the wasabi. Number three, ice cream cake. If you're craving ice cream, head to Toronto. They broke the world record for the biggest ice cream cake, a little over 10 tons to be specific. It took 14 hours, 100 volunteers, 20,000 pounds of ice cream, 200 pounds of sponge cake, and over 300 pounds of icing and crumbled Oreo cookies to make this gigantic creation. They really should include the caloric count in these creations as well. Imagine being in graduate school and having a professor ask you to make the biggest ice cream cake in the world and make sure that it doesn't collapse on itself or melt. It seems like an odd situation, but that's exactly what happened at the University of Toronto. 
A class of students studying chemical engineering and applied chemistry were the masterminds behind this creation. Dairy Queen sponsored the making of the mega dessert in honor of the 30th anniversary of its ice cream cake, beating the record set in 2006 in Beijing by 500 pounds. Number two. Sandwich. Mexican school kids might be needing bigger box lunches if the latest record holding sandwich sets a trend. Bakers in Mexico City worked together to make a cheese, ham, and lettuce sandwich that weighed over 7,000 pounds. Mexico's largest bread company, Bimbo Bread, led the effort and said the sandwich was, quote, a pride for Mexico. The giant sandwich beat the previous record set in 2003 in Birmingham, England. 24 people took part in the event, and an oven was built especially for the sandwich. Reps from the Guinness Book of Records said that it was a fantastic experience and that the process had been an absolute pleasure to watch for them. To be honest, I can say that being a Guinness rep for any of these food events has to be an absolute pleasure because, let's be for real, there's going to be plenty of food to go around. Number one. Omelette. Breakfast, anyone? The largest omelette ever created weighed a whopping 14,225 pounds, and it was achieved by Portuguese chefs in Portugal. It took a team of 55 people six hours to make this omelette, led by head chef Pedro Mendes. The pan used to make the omelette weighed over 9,000 pounds itself, as it was 33 feet in diameter. The chefs used 145,000 eggs, 880 pounds of oil, and 220 pounds of butter. Mmm. To make this challenge just a bit more expensive, all eggs used were free range and they were donated by Uno Ovo, the largest egg producer in the country. The previous Guinness World Record for the largest omelette was 9,702 pounds, which was cooked up in Turkey back in October 2010. Here's what's next. I'm pretty sure there are much tastier parts of the lamb other than its head. Roasted lamb's head is a popular dish eaten before Christmas in Norway. It used to be the poor that ate it, but today, it's a delicacy. Mm-mm, count me out. Do you like rotting carcasses and seal fat? Well, then I